Hey guys, it's Erica. Um, right now I am outside of a Goodwill and I'm going to show you how I get some pots for cheap. Now when you go to thrift stores or secondhand stores, there's always a possibility that there's not going to be any pots at all or sometimes they might be expensive. Like sometimes there's some expensive pots in there. I'm not sure why but there's varying prices. Also. For depending on what kind of thrift store you're going to, like if you go to a Goodwill or you go to a Salvation Army, they have different deals depending on where you go. So be sure to always check at the front to see if they have any deals going on. And then if you find that color tag or whatever's going on, then you get an even better deal. So this is a way that I got a bunch of my pots. Um, mostly they have, sometimes they have some cool looking ones, sometimes they only have terracotta or whatever but you know a pot's a pot and at this point the collection is filling up too much to <laughs> be picky about what kind of pots I have so yeah let's see what they have okay here's a few pots This pot used to have an orc in it. Oh, another one here. $1.99. None of them have drainage holes except for this one. $2. Maybe. Also find stuff like this. I know this used to have a hyacinth in it. Three dollars. There's so many um, bases like this that you can use for propagations. The biggest issue with trying to find pots is that they don't have drainage holes. But you can always drill them or keep them in their nursery pot and then water them outside of the pot that you find. Yeah. 
I wish I had a hole in it, because I would get it if it did. Okay, there's also the for only six dollars. That's a steal if you ask me. This thing is huge. It's like in like a little tree or something. It has like a really big monster. Small terrarium, like a little baby one. Two dollars. but I don't want to take plant. Like something like this, you could maybe put like a plant on it and use it as like a tray for the water to drain out. I don't know how good wood is for that, but maybe a different material. I think that's it for this good wall. Testing these little plants. Are they stunning? <laughs> I feel like someone stole the pot and left this behind. Hmm. No drainage hole. Four dollars, pretty good. I'm not trying to take out all of this styrofoam inside though. Okay, so I just finished shopping. I went to three different Goodwills, but they were all kind of close together, so it was okay. Um, I only got two pots, so like I said, there sometimes isn't any pots. Sometimes though, there's like a bunch of pots. One time I went in, there was like ten terracotta pots and they were all different sizes but they were kind of expensive so I didn't get any 
Um, so these are the ones that I got. I got this one. And I know that it was from an orchid. I got it for $2 from an orchid because I've seen this pot with orchids in it. They're, maybe they were from Walmart or something. But I've seen multiple, multiple ones of those. And then I got this big, what was it again? 8.25 inch uh, terracotta pot for $3. That's pretty good. So that big pot is only $1 more than this tiny pot. So in total, what was that? $5 for two pots. I think that's pretty good. I've definitely spent a lot on some other pots before, like over $30, but you know, and then even if I don't need that size pot, I'll still buy it because there's always times when you have too many plants and not enough pots or too many pots and not enough plants. And I think it's always better to have too many pots and not enough plants because that means you could always grow your collection. Um, yeah, so there's other ways to get cheap pots too, you know, like Ross, TJ Maxx. Um, I wouldn't suggest flea markets because I think their stuff is very expensive. One time I saw this little pot and it was, it was like this. It was ceramic and just plain white. And the guy told me that it was $45 because it was like a home and garden pot or something like that. So yeah, there's definitely deals you could find anywhere. Um, thrift stores is definitely a place that you could check out. Um, yeah, so that's it for today's video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I post new videos every single day. And thanks so much for watching. Bye!